Hey, I'm Birdman. I'm Michael. Time to get on target at the Hub Phoenix. The Hub Phoenix. The Hub <laughs> Phoenix. That's right. <laughs> it's rising. Right? They always get that bird vision for right. Phoenix. So, yeah. You it's know. kind of funny because, like, HBO just added uh, the Harry Potter series to the, like, app. Oh. So I've been watching them. Nice. And, like, last night was uh, the one where the Phoenix comes in. Or oh, the yeah, Chamber of yeah, Secrets yeah, where the yeah, Phoenix yeah. comes and saves him. So totally, totally understand That's it. Dumbledore's bird, right? Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> yep. Um, so what are we talking about today? Well, we've been talking about 1911s. Uh, last week we talked about Cabot's. Uh, the week before we kind of showed everyone all the guns we're going to kind of talk about. Um, this week we're talking about Nighthawk Custom. Nice. So... One thing I want to shout out to is Otter Arms. Um, Otter Arms actually makes all of these stands for the hubs. Um, you're going to start seeing them come into more of the locations. Tucson has a ton of them. He's slowly getting more machines and getting his stuff up to speed. And eventually, I'm going to try to have every pistol in our case on an Otter Arms stand. Um, what's cool about them is, is they are completely changeable so i'm going to go ahead and pull a pistol off here and so we're looking at the stand right um we can actually push what? up and remove the mag insert so i can change this to a barrel one to where the gun is actually going to sit into the barrel oh um i can this is a 1911 style he makes sigs glocks um any pistol you want, Holy crap. Um, you just tell him the diameters and he can actually um, design it and then make it. And what's cool is they just insert right into a little groove and then push down and it basically hides the seam. So Very super scary cool. scrunch sound. It actually sounds kind of cool. Yeah. <laughs> um, they're, they're all 3D printed. That's crazy. Um, and he is just a magician with it. Um, so he's actually a local TPD officer. Um, so super cool in that respect. Um, not only are we supporting a local um, business, but a local law enforcement business. Um, so I really like that aspect. Super cool. Um, he actually just sold one to Donald Trump Jr. Um, we have one in the store because we have a Trump 1911 themed gun. So he made a Trump stand that has the red, white, and blue for Trump, it's got Trump's outline with the the gold hair, and then an, uh, <laughs> a red, white, and blue theme on the uh, on the inside. And wow. Donald Trump Jr. actually bought one. So um, there you go, super cool. So um, if you ever need any, we sell them. Um, he also sells them. Um, so if you have any questions, reach out to us. Um, we'll be your liaison. We'll be your middleman for that, um, and get you set up. But. I love these. Um, they really set us apart. Um, we have manufacturers come in and actually go, hey, uh, what are you doing there? Can we get some of those? So Shadow Systems actually has some of these coming for them. Um, Quarter Circle 10 um, came into our store and was like, uh, yeah, we got to have that. Um, so you're going to start seeing these. Nighthawk uh, really liked it. I don't have the Nighthawk Agency one, but we did one of those. We've done Shadow. Um, um, staccato, just a bunch of them. So make sure you reach out for that. I love these. They're awesome. Um, and he can make some with, uh, like, for an EDC um, kit. So, like, if you wanted to put this next to your bedside, he could do a barrel one so that you have your gun ready to go loaded, not like the mag insert. Right. You've got a spare mag next to it with a little tray that you can put your keys and whatnot. So he can kind of design it to you. He makes card ones that also hold guns. So, like, if you have a desk at work um, and you want to have a gun sitting there ready to go, you can have your business cards with a gun <laughs> right there ready to go. Like, yeah, so uh, if this deal doesn't go good, I don't know what's going to happen here, but uh, you can definitely grab one of my business oh, cards right there. Uh-huh, and the 44 mag. Um, so, Otter Arms, make sure you check those out. Tucson. Come into the hub, check them out. Um, Phoenix and Tucson have them. Lakeside will start getting them. Um, so I'm going to put this back on there and not touch it again. And, uh, I like it. to, I like to touch stuff. So like if it's in front of me, I try to 
Just sit there and grab it. We just gave up on trying to post it as if live on YouTube. They yeah. just posted the heck with you people. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it kept being an issue of like, oh, you touched it. YouTube can't figure that out for some reason. Um, so. Even though we said that this was pre-recorded, because um, it was never live, uh, ever. So anyway, Nighthawk Custom. I love Nighthawk Customs. I don't um, have this much money. I want all these guns, and I just don't have this much money. But anyways. Yeah. <laughs> it's very hard when you look at Night... When we go to a, a show, we were just at a show, and we went to the Nighthawk Customs booth, and you see some of the finishes that... Like, you've had some of these guns in your store, but you haven't seen that finish. Right. And you're like, whoa, 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 what's that? <laughs> They're like, oh, yeah, yeah, that's the rose gold. Oh, oh, yeah, okay, uh, we need two of those. Um, what's that gun? Oh, well, that's the new one we just came out with. Uh, yeah, we need that one too. Um, oh, hey, just so you know, we're, uh, we're talking about releasing, uh, a double stack in these models at shot. Oh, yeah. Okay. We're gonna, <laughs> we're gonna definitely take some of those. And it's like, uh, they send you an order for like $130,000 and you're like, okay, okay, sweet. <laughs> so no, Nighthawk is super easy to spend money with. Um, what I like is, is like Cabot, everything has a purpose, um, but yet still gorgeous. Oh, yeah. You know, um, the way that they do things, um, one gun, one gunsmith. Um, so, um, and Cabot's the same way. They don't really pass these down a line and then, oh, hey, I'm the good trigger guy. Give me the triggers. Oh, I'm good at the install of the sights. I'll right, do those. Right. No, 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 no. Jim Bob started this gun. Jim Bob finishes this gun, does all the trigger work, all the sight work, um, all the fitting, everything. So if something is wrong with this gun, Jim Bob did it. Um, no one else. Um, and I like that. Um, and they don't have guns that have issues, or if they do, they're very good at hiding it. Um, so no, anyway, I'm just making a joke. But these are just a few. Um, in Phoenix alone, I think we have eight or nine uh, Nighthawks. And then in Tucson, I think we have 10 or 12, maybe more. Um, we used to have a Korth up here. Korth are the, uh, the revolvers that Nighthawk sells. Um, I don't have, we sold the one up here just a little while ago. Um, they come over from Germany, um, handmade revolvers um, at the highest level. Gorgeous. And same thing beyond gorgeous, but practical. So um, you could get like a mongoose that actually has a rail. Um, um, they make model, the DLX, which has multiple rails on, it's got like a quad rail. So you could have like a laser, a light, wow. an optic, um, you know, really forward thinking, um, crazy aggressive triggers that are so light. So the, the actions are so smooth. The cylinders don't mar themselves as they spin like most revolvers do. Just top, top, top. Right. However, five, I'd say like base price 4,000 can go up to the eight, nine grand area very wow. easily. Wow. Um, Nighthawk just started selling 1911, or I'm sorry, 1911. Been selling 1911. Um, they just started selling shotguns actually. Oh, wow. <clears throat> um, we posted a picture on our Facebook, Instagram, um, at the show, a single shot semi-automatic shotgun. So. Okay. Explain that because single shot to me would be single shot, but how right. is semi-automatic then? Right. So the rounds actually f are held in the stock. And so when you break open it. The, you can actually see the magazine tube. Oh, okay. And so it feeds the single round. So it'd be like single shot auto load. Yeah. Yeah, okay, okay. So super different, um, like a break open auto load. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, um, yeah. So just super different. Um, it's been actually, it's been, it was designed in like the 1800s or 1900s. It's still semi -automatic. You know, like, I mean, yeah. Yeah, it. so, it. Yeah, yeah. so, it just hasn't ever really been brought over to the U.S. Um, the the design is so extreme and so complicated. It, the guns are twenty to fifty thousand dollars. So hey, but it's not a one point two million dollar nineteen eleven, right? Um, <laughs> this is a different. You know, these are we're, we're we're these are brands that work with 
customers that yeah. money really, and I hate to say it like this, is no object. Um, what do I want to buy today? You know what I mean? It doesn't matter. Um, so, and then you have some people that are just straight up gun nuts that are shooters that are like, no, I got to have that. I'll sell four of my guns or five of my guns to get that $20,000 shotgun. I don't care. Um, so, but we actually have a 12 gauge on order, um, coming. Um, I was just floored by it. I know I have some clients that'll go crazy over it. So we've got one of those on order. I'm excited for that. Um, I will actually shoot Rob a picture, that picture of the action. We'll, we'll put it into this video cool. um, so that you can see it. Um, so, but anyway, getting back to what Nighthawk really does a lot of, which is 1911s. So we have three different examples here. Um, the President, the GRP double stack, and then the Nighthawk Agent 2 Custom. Um, Nighthawk partnered with um, Agency Arms on the Agent 2. Um, they also have the Agent 1 or the Agent, um, and then they also make both with rail and without. Um, the President, I absolutely am in love with. The way that they did the slide cuts. Um, I'm a big gold sucker. Um, so anything with gold barrels or, you know, gold on it, I really like it. Um, super, super cool, beyond gorgeous. Um, as you can see, most all of their guns, um, I'm going to turn it towards. The, I just did that too. The, the, you're talking about the, yeah. the camphor on the, the uh, barrel. Yeah. That's just different. Yeah. You'll so that actually that. helps with accuracy, um, a lot. Um, and then on top of. You know, from just a look standpoint, it's gorgeous. Oh, yeah. You know, it really adds to the pistol. But there is a point to it. I mean, it, it, it does make the guns more accurate. Um, so you've got that. Um, all of these are going to be your standard 1911 with your barrel lug. Um, so you actually will push this little detent back here, turn that, and that's how your slide comes off, you know, um, comes apart. So that's how you get your barrel out. Um, they're all locking lug and um, just super, super high end. So you can see each gun has different cuts, different finishes. Um, you know, they can do scales, they can do serrations, um, they can do beveled serrations like on the Agent 2 where they actually, it's cut, but then kind of gets, goes out. So yeah. um, deep in the back, high in the front. Um, just different levels of, of finishes and cuts and sights. Um, so like on the GRP, we've got a um, set of sights with um, basically what I call like eight ball. You've got a dot in the rear and a dot in the front. You put the two dots on top of each other. You make that eight, you know you're on. Um, super fast target acquisition, um, all black rear. Um, and then the cool thing is, is they're, they're uh, tritium so that you can see them at night. Um, GRP, usually that stands for Global Research Pistol, um, I would think, um, I, if I remember right. Um, so kind of like a all around, do it all. Um, this one you can get with a rail, just like the agent. Um, this guy I chose not to. Um, I was, on this one I was thinking more of kind of like a three gun style, you know, more competition, but still not optic um, focused. So I didn't really think it needed a light um, or laser or anything like that. So we didn't do that one without the, we did that one without the rail. But that's the cool thing about Nighthawk is, is you can do different things. Order it the way you want it, personalize it to you. Exactly. Cool. Exactly. So um, they work with a bunch of different site manufacturers. You can get a bunch of different optics, Holosun, Trigicon. You can get, the cool thing I like about Nighthawk is, is you can say, you know what? I want it with the optic and the light on it from factory. Boom. So um, I don't want to have to do any other things. Give me that price with everything on it loaded. Um, and I like that about them. So, and same thing from a dealer standpoint, we can say, you know what? No, don't put the light, don't put the optic. Give me everything else though. When it comes to the store, we'll add those so we can make our margin. Um, so they really give us that freedom. Um, 
trigger pulls, trigger styles. As you can see, they do cut triggers um, that we have. They do flat triggers. They do flat triggers with curves on the with little curves out on the bottom. So kind of same thing. You've got options. Um, you've got square trigger guards. You've got curved trigger guards. Um, certain guns can't come with, you know, like you couldn't say I want an Agent 2 with a square trigger guard. They don't do that. However, there may be a chance that they make a double stack Agent 2 in the future. Ooh. Maybe. We're <clears> hoping. <throat> we're praying. Um, and then it'll get the square trigger guard. So, um, lots of different things. Um, I didn't grab the 10 mil. I ran out of um, arm, like, Fingers. ability. Yeah, I'm, just, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm not going to put 10 guns together on my hands that are, you know. No hole in the wall yet. Right. Um, so <laughs> um, I didn't bring over the 10 mil, but we had, the cool thing is, is they do long side guns. Um, so if you think to, uh, you know, um, um, Terminator, Arnold Schwarzenegger, you know, long side 45, um, you know, where exactly like, th like this gun with just a barrel that goes to like here. So super cool, super different. <laughs> Um, we've got those next door in 10 mil. We can get them in 45, 9, whatever caliber. That's the cool thing, too, is any of these guns can be ordered in basically any caliber. So, um, like the Agent 2 here is in 9. We can get it in 45. Um, the GRP is in 9. Majority of the... It's funny. When I first got into guns, you would never order a 1911 in 9. Just wouldn't. No. Um, it it just, wouldn't sell. <laughs> yeah. Um, you know, you had the Agent 2 and a couple other, you know, um, basically like subcompact 1911s, um, officer style 1911s that were in 9mm. Um, you had the Mustang 380, um, you know, those were kind of. Then you, then SIG came out with the um, 238, 938. Um, you know, kind of mini 1911s, Springfield, the 911, and, um, you know, okay, it's getting a little bit better. Well, then the competition world kind of went off, and 9 mil really, you know, oh, well, hey, I want that 1911 in 9 so that I can shoot it on the weekend. Um, ammo's cheap, less recoil. Oh, and I gained capacity by going to 9. Yeah. So, um, you know, and then technology pumped into nine and and the 45 realistically while it does have more you know it's a bigger bullet sure it doesn't necessarily equate to more stopping power um so people looked at it and now i would say majority of 1911s are probably sold in nine um you know especially in the 2011 game um nine millimeter is kind of king um 40 and 45 are less ordered um 38 super I think has even kind of gone down a little bit um, because now you've got nine major um, and stuff like that. And so these guys are really just nines the the ticket right now. So a lot of the guns we order in nine. However, if you came in and were like, Mike, I got to have this gun just in 45, we could do it very easily. Cool. So anyway, Nighthawk Customs, 100% um, custom. Everything's made there. Um, I, th their presentation, the bet, you know, they give you this really nice carry case that comes with multiple magazines. Um, just very, very concierge, build it to the way you want it, just like cabinet service. Um, all of these are shooters. Um, the double stacks are even more of a shooter just because you, not only do you get capacity, but you really can get a good grip onto that gun. Um, I love them the way that they feel and, and shoot. Um, so, yeah, that's Nighthawk Custom. Um, as you said, it's very hard because you're like, okay, I, really, I think I want that gun. <laughs> and then you like look down and you're like, oof, Ow. four grand. Okay, well, no, not today. Um, but it's 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 that's kind of cool thing about what we have is we've got that layaway. So five months, twenty percent down. You know, a thousand dollars a month. You know, a little under a thousand dollars a month, and you can get that four or five thousand dollar gun. There you go. So, anyway, I'm Michael. I'm Birdman. We'll see you next time.